No one has got AF clue what Brexit is Danny Dyer discussing Britain's vote to quit the EU, Danny, pictured, blasted, no one has got AF clue what Brexit is. And the 40-year-old EastEnders star went on to take aim at former Prime Minister David Cameron, twice branding him on the Live ITV show and accusing the politician of scuttling off after plunging the country into the confusion of EU withdrawal. Yesterday Mr Cameron's representative made clear he would not be responding to the outburst, saying, that's not something we will be commenting on however Danny's tirade has won huge support across social media. One fan tweeted, I'd vote for Danny Dyer for PM after his inspirational political analysis. Even Theresa May turned a blind eye to the brutal tongue lashing. A number 10 spokesperson said, like any other commentators, people who appear on broadcast are perfectly entitled to their opinion. But the PM might want to be careful with bookmakers slashing prices on the actor turning his hand to politics. The Queen Vic's current landlord has odds of just 33-1 to become an MP and 50-1 to serve as the next London mayor. Worth a punt? Sounds like Sheridan Smith's role in upcoming film The More You Ignore Me was challenging, even for a BAFTA, winning actress such as herself. I play a character called Gina with schizophrenia, explained Sheridan, 37, on Radio 2's Chris Evans' breakfast show yesterday, adding, at one point she climbs on the roof. Thankfully there was a medical expert on hand to advise her in the comedy drama, out next Friday which was penned by comic and former psychiatric nurse Joe Brand. He was always on set, as was Joe, because my character is heavily medicated so he advised on details about little twitches and things that the meds would have caused. Meanwhile, Sheridan put paid to rumors that her engagement to Jamie Horn, 28, was off as she sported her 10,000-pound sparkler. BGT's Lost Voice Guy to tour Uck Britain's Got Talent winner Lost Voice Guy has announced that he will headline his first national tour in 2019. The comic, real name Lee Ridley, will play the first of 36 dates in Barnsley on February 2nd with support from last year's BGT semi-finalist. Johnny Awesome the announcement shows that the stand-up, who has been a long time hit in his native Northeast and won a BBC New Comedy Award in 2014 is continuing to take the country by storm. Since his victory on the ITV talent show, the 37-year-old has starred in and written for his own Radio 4 comedy series, Ability, which has just been recommissioned. In the past he has performed as a support for fellow comics Patrick Keelty and Ross Noble. Lee, who suffers from cerebral palsy, cannot talk so communicates by electronic voice and is believed to be the first comedian to do so. Jennifer Lopez's ambitious daughter has set her sights on a literary career, despite being 10 years old. Tickets go on sale from Tuesday. The Latina singer took to social media to reveal that she has teamed up with her little girl M. Maribel to co-author a children's book. It's a very special day, J. Lo explained in a video to her 76.3 million customers, ahem, followers, before adding, M and I are off to our very first book publishers meeting for an idea M had for a book. The clip shows the child holding a draft cover, entitled Lord Help Me, in the backseat of a car en route to a potentially lucrative powwow. We're excited, we have three meetings. In 2014 the 48-year-old released her memoir True Love, which seems to have served as inspiration for M to put pen to paper too. 